guy. As a man, this is the hardest decision I've ever taken in my life. Allowing my own fiance to go and take care of her ex. <laughs> One day, all the quite risky. All the very, very risky. <laughs> ah! The man James. The man James. You can never stop amazing me. <laughs> You're a bad guy. I understand why you're saying it's risky because I did a jazz on Afuchon, no okay? <laughs> yeah, this guy. <laughs> but you know you're a bad guy. Yo. <laughs> Anyways, the good thing about it is that the man is incapacitated. You and I know that. You know? Someone who asks for help to get up, do you think he will have what it takes to be able to do shiko shiko on top of a woman? He won't be able to sleep with a girl now. So your thing is still saved. <laughs> Besides, the doctor said that his last man is short, meaning he may die soon. So you have nothing to worry about. <laughs> you don't see it? Bro, the problem here is whenever they are together, there is this connection. You know, there's this connection that exists between them. And whenever it comes around, Messi will just act and pretend like nothing is really happening. Of course. What else do you expect? That is obviously supposed to be that connection and tied in fact chemistry and if you're there now she's not supposed to start acting like a total stranger to somebody that she has been for over five years <laughs> obviously there's supposed to be that connection of course you understand <laughs> well um anyway he's just a dying man huh yes and i wouldn't want god to blame me that way i contributed to his death you understand? If not, there is no how I will allow Messi to go there. I beg, may we go down our joint, go do one or two. Guys, leave this is your talk now. Sorry. You're so kind. You were kind to me before. And you saved my life. Toby, I would do everything to make sure you get back on your feet. I'm also talking to a foreign doctor. I told him about your condition and he said there's a possibility you will live. What's the point to live? Tell me, what is the point? Why did you just let me live for six months and die? No. Yes. You will not die. Mercy, seeing you get married to another man will make me miserable. I can't take it. You won't die. You will leave to be a better man for your mother and for yourself. Excuse me.
cross my mind, I've been immersed, been afraid. He got me right on the hook, yeah, I love you, my Marista, he loves me, he cares for me. I love you, Marista, I think that I lost my mind, I've been immersed, been afraid. He got me right on the hook, yeah, I love you, my Marista, he loves me, he cares for me. Yes, Marista. to drink water. I'm not here for you. Hmm? I am here to cover up for mercy, my friend, who went to the office to handle some things. You think I'm one of those women you can sweet talk? Hmm? I'm not one of those ladies. So don't take me for granted. Bella, if I have ever offended you, I'm sorry. What is that? If you have over or what? I don't know. I don't understand. If you've offended me many times and you're saying if. Please. I'm thirsty. <laughs> Can I have some water to drink? You're thirsty. You see? You see how life is? Hmm? You are pooping in your body right now. You are urinating on your body. You see, all oh, this is your gara gara, all oh, this is your coffee. Beating women anyhow, treating people anyhow. Last lad, this is where you are, on a wheelchair. Want to drink water? Don't worry. Let me go and get you water to drink. looking at me like that stop looking at me like that don't melt my heart with this your look it won't work for me what is it see eh? see if it's not because of me eh I'll push you down from this wheelchair I will do worse things to you. In fact, I will break your bones. Not because of her. But you see, if I hear any of these things from her, if you tell her any of these things, hmm, you will die the next day. You are a wicked man. You are a real monster. You are shedding tears. You are sense man. I have to face reality. I see a strong connection between Mercy and Toby, even in his present condition. The way Mercy play and laugh with him, and each time I come, she will just adjust. This shows that she is just with me for pity. I need to tell myself the truth. I am a man. I need to be loved and not for pity. No. I granted Mercy the permission to stay with him. It is true he can't make love considering his condition. And I have no right to accuse Mercy for anything. But God, I am so jealous. Me that is healthy. 
I don't even flow with her as she flows with that guy. God, I need help. I have waited for Miss Messi long enough. Right now, I need to run along. I have an emergency at the hospital. Okay. Uh, however, I left some drugs with him on the table with prescription on how to take them. I also gave him an injection that will heal the bones. Um, if it works, he will be able to stand up. However, we need clutches that will help him to move around okay. uh, with the help of a human being. Mm. And I hope that works as well. It's true. That will show that he's being healed from the illness. Wow. That is very good, doctor. I'll Thank tell you. her everything. All right. However, he's sleeping at the moment. Okay. okay. But it is normal. Okay, the injection I gave to him is very strong. Mm. And uh, all you need to do is to check on him time to time. I will do it. Okay. I will. You'll be okay. Thank you very much. All right. So you don't need to worry yourself. Right. So have Thank a lovely day. Very much, doctor. All right. I really appreciate it. Let me run along. All right. All right. Thank you. Yeah, bye bye. So sorry. That is great. Easy. Yeah. You did amazing. What about my kiss? Is that your request? I thought you were going to request for money. You that I know. Money doesn't move me anymore. Yes. Even if I have all the money in this world, it's worthless. But getting a kiss from you can help with my healing. He got me right on the hook, yeah, I love you. My brother, he loves me, he cares for me. Where's my skin? Deep it in eyes. What? <laughs> This is it! You! You know! Faith! Faith! Yes. Drink here. Make 
Make sure you bring one bottle here every 20, 20 minutes. I have my money, I will pay. Is it our money? I will pay. Come on, Jeff. Are we not drinking? Are you? Uh, we don't know. Are drink you stupid and mess yourself up with drinks? Are you a widow? Shit, Jeff. Demon Jeff, what are you doing? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Ah, you have to put yourself together now. Hey, man, no. You can't come out here and embarrass yourself with so much bottles. You know, I wonder you about this. I saw it coming and I told you. You were bent on giving Missy attention rather than giving Juliet attention that I told you about. For you to start taking drinks like a drunk guy. So this thing now, you won't even be able to stand up and walk with your two legs now. Says who? With these things you have, this thing is, is, is saying it. Look at how many bottles. Who knows if they have taken some inside? It's not just thing you're doing. I'm not to face this way. Jason, if you may ask, you will have to marry the one that loves you much more than you do. In that case, the marriage will stay. <laughs> now tell me, what do you know about love? Give Juliet a chance. You can actually change that girl to the woman you desire. I'm not seeing any difficult tax there. Give that girl little attention with the kind of love I've seen her shown to you. That girl will be a good wife. Think about this thing. Now come, I have to take you home. Change over, electrician. I've heard you. Guy, you are drunk. Stop now. The more of this you take, you, you won't be able to stand. Guy, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Stop. What is wrong with you now? Eh? Take you home. Come. Oh, okay. It's relax. I want to, I want to pee. I want to pee. Okay. Let's, 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 let's go. Uh -uh. I want to be with you. What do you mean? Hey, stop that! Am I this? What are you doing inside the toilet? Please come and stop See. See what you're doing to yourself. What are you doing inside the toilet? Security! It's a public place. Security! Come on, please, hold on. Let me take him to come. Come in. Stop now. Demand it. Stop now. No, 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 no. You're passing yourself for now. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
exactly what she did with Toby. You see this girl here? She's the reason why Toby and I separated. Juliet. So you know Toby? Toby and I were not meant to be. I'm meant for you, James. Please, I'm a changed person. Please. This is nonsense. Now get out. Get out! Get out! Out. I do not want to see her here. Get out to get out here. You heard my wife. No, please. Out, out. Out! Get out! Drop this. You have showed me nothing but love. And the last thing I would want to do is hurt your feelings. I would never want to do that. You're the realest man that I have ever seen. For letting me go take care of my ex. That's the hardest decision for any man to make. But you led me through. I just want you to know that I love you so much. And I love you too. You know it, right? <laughs> you know I love you more. I know. I love you. And I will do anything to make you happy. All I want is your happiness. What are you trying to say? Draw the line towards anything that will make you happy. And that's why you're the best. So, now that you are here with me, who is taking care of me? My friend Bella. I told her I'll be sleeping over here. So, I begged her to help me take care of him. And she accepted. Good. So, what is your next plan? Or are you going to be there taking care of him forever? Uh, no. No. After six months, I will leave. And uh, by then, he should be able to take care of himself. Or maybe get a nanny. That's what I plan to do. It's okay. But thank you. Thank you for letting me do this. Thank you. <laughs> Let's go to bed. This boy, you are a witch. You know how to penetrate into people's hearts with this so witchcraft. But it will not affect me. I know who I am. Eh? You're using this your sweet mouth and this your cunning attitude to make waves into Mrs. Heart again, right? You see?
what is it again? Eh? Eh? Why is your face like that? I am sorry. I'm sorry, just that you messed things up. Eh? And this time around, it is too late. With you, it's not too late. Is that what you think? Yes, it's your fault. It's me, it's not it. Oh, you know all these things. But when I came here, I've comforted you the way you were treating me. You wanted to fight me. You wanted to beat me up. Now look at you. Huh? Look at your drugs. Take your drugs. I don't have anything to say to you. that you have a heart of gold. Thief. You know I'm doing very well. Mercy, if I shouldn't be grateful for anything, I should be grateful to God for bringing me into my life. I thank God for hope that I will live and breathe the air of life, hoping that I will work again and not branded to die in the next six months. God bless you. And oh, um, I cooked for you. You did what? I cooked. Though it was stressful, I had to reciprocate the love you, you know, showed me. Knowing that you're going to be someone else's wife, If only I could turn the hands of time, I would rewrite all I have done. But it's too late. I would have to live with the regret knowing that I've lost you forever. You didn't lose me, okay? Yes, I, I know I'm going to be someone else's wife. still there and we're friends friends you say that is not enough knowing that I'm not going to see you every day it's boring do you know that could actually reduce my longevity Toby please 
Can you stop saying this? You don't have to wish death upon yourself. You are fine. I'm thinking that I lost my mind and being a mess, being afraid. He got me right on the yes, who is that? I love you, my mercy. How many guys open? He cursed for me. I love you, mercy. Ha! Right. Hmm. This how you came to my house today. I don't have food though. Must I be known for food alone? I'm a grown-up man now. See, I bought something for you. This you. You bought this for me? Wow, thank you very, very much. Thank you. You're welcome. Damn. Um, Bella. Yes? You know, I might not have rich parents like the way you people do. But I managed to pass through the four walls of the university. And yet, there is no job. And that's why I managed to live my life on the low the way I see it. So, I don't know. Um, don't see me as if the only value I have in this life is food. So, and that's why I managed to. Please, please, please. Stop, stop. stop. It's okay. I am not judging you, Bright. I was only joking, okay? I'm sorry about that. Please let me go and get you something to eat. No, 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 thank you. I, I didn't come here for food. I came here for a very important thing. What is it? Bella, what about that stuff I told you about the other day in Toby's house? I'm, I'm very serious about it. I want you to make me a complete man. Bright, did anybody tell you to come and tell me all these things? No, I came here on my own. Just have to sit Okay, let me go and get this up. James now allows you to drive his car, spend his money. My dear, he sent me to come and buy something for him. And then stock up his house. Of course, I'll use the car. You see what I'm saying? That guy loves you. Yes. You know, there's some person that don't know how to say it, you see? Action speaks louder than words. True, but anyway, everything concerning me, I have handed it over to God. I've got this one. I've got the runner for me. I've got the runner for me too. <laughs> that he's recovering speedily. Thank you so much. Thank you. So, I need to retire back to the house. My fiance is really worried. We we're supposed to be here together, but he went back to the house. That man is a good man, and I don't want to hurt him. Um, the guy is almost fit, but he still needs some mental correction and experience. He was able to rec uh, recover quickly because you have a strong connection with him. And it's that connect that has made him to be active. Uh, the result has been out because of that connection. You see, paralysis is something that has a connection with the brain. And the brain needs to be setting before it can reset. This thing is really affecting my relationship. Can't we get him a nanny at this point so I can return back to the house? Well, you can go back to the house. 
if the guy is not so dear to you, that if anything happens, you can be here. But if he's so dear to you, then try and give him some time to reset. Toby is very dear to me. He was supposed to be my husband, but I guess the devil manipulated him. But now I am entangled and committed to someone, and I don't want to break his heart or hurt him. I understand how you feel. All right. I understand it. But you know, this has to do with saving someone's life. I know this has lingered for over four to five months now. Yes, I know. But just in a month time or so, he might be okay you know, to go out and play with friends and stay with other people. Hmm? But thank you. Thank you for the marvelous job you did. Thank you. Yes, God. I almost lost hope when the doctors said he was going to die. Uh, no. It is not totally his fault. It is from the lab technicians. You know, the result was not clearly stated. But it is good he is getting better now. Yeah. So, let me take my leave. I love you, Marsta. I think that I lost my mind being a mess, being afraid. He got me right on the hook. I love you, my Marsta. He loves me. He cares for me. Where's my skin? Deep it in eyes. It's fine. You did great. What about my gift? Um, I'll be the one to choose your gift. Hmm, what do I give you? <laughs> I am someone's wife now. So back off.
Bella. Come. Bella. I'm so happy for your kind of person to make me a complete man. This really shows that true love has no boundary. See, I've been monitoring you closely and I've seen that you're a very straightforward person. The only thing there is that whenever you are angry, you go extra miles to prove your anger. But I love you. I love you too. You know I love you so much. I truly love you. I have no doubt that you love me. I'm not doubting it. Remember I told you that I'm willing to do and support anything that will make you happy. You once told me how to be saved your life. And I'll be so heartless if I stop you from not rewarding him back the way you deserve. That's it. Yes. Yeah, I love you. Thanks for understanding. I love you too. It's okay. Mm -hmm. How serious are you with what you just told me? <laughs> Bro, you won't believe me. I have not had any kind of knowledge of her. Yes, one day I never enter. Though I tried on several occasions, but she wouldn't let me. She stopped me. But it's okay, I'm not complaining. But there was a day she offered it to me willingly. But I knew it wasn't her mind. Because that day, I saw her and Toby. Okay. On a compromising mood. Yes. So I know she wanted to like make me happy that day. But trust me, I turned her down. I didn't do it. I asked her to take her time. <laughs> That's exactly what I've been telling you. You see, Juliet now that has been claiming a born again person has been begging you to come and eat or show free for free. You don't want to grab opportunity. <laughs> Yeah? It is somebody that doesn't want to give you that you are busy dying for. Yeah? Uh, bro, it's not as if I'm not interested, okay? But I think the right thing for me to do now is to strike my balance with Mercy. For now, I will not have anything to do with Juliet. The principal man that has been busy meeting bad, bad women. <laughs> Do not get me wrong. Okay. Mercy is not bad. Mm. Yes. Actually, I I was the one who authorized her to go and take care of Toby. Though initially I kicked against it, but she explained to me how Toby once saved her life. 
And you know now we are all human, so I wouldn't want to stop her from paying back. So I decided to let her go. So she's not as bad as you think. <laughs> Mercy is just a sweet soul. <laughs> The man Jay, I've never knew this aspect of you. In fact, I should be calling you Reverend Father James. You should have been a Reverend Father now. Eh? <laughs> okay. You know we are living our life, but in as much as we are living this life, we have to be honest with life. That's it, guy. If that's it. Me, I know if you want me to tell you, but can I just tell you something? If I were to be you on that very day, I engaged her. One me a tire go for that bag and tire and tap of Sayota. If not, I will collect my ring immediately. Not here. Hey, hey. Mrs. Brown, in anticipation. Hey, hey that's again. Now, wow. <laughs> you don't see her now. The first shall be the last. And the last shall be the first. Yes. Within one month, you're already engaged and the marriage date is fixed. It's God. I'm so happy for you. I mean, who would have believed that Brett would ever get serious with life? Who? I'm so happy for you, baby girl. Congrats, 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 congrats. Thank you. Thank you, my dear friend. Okay. Um. So, I want to invite you and Bright for Toby's survival party. Okay. Yes. Yes. Though I know Toby's still going to tell Bright. But I want you to know that you both are highly invited for the survival party. Of course. I go there then. now. I okay. must show. And after that, I'll be going home that very day. So I can go fix my own home as well. <laughs> <laughs> my worry is now is that. For you to go and meet your fiancé, that guy has really tried. He has. Yes, he has. But I'm worried because I I feel like my stay in Toby's house is changing him. But I understand him. I understand him. I just don't want to believe that he's cheating on me. I because if I catch him cheating, well, I don't believe so. No, no, no. He can't cheat on you. He can. Excuse me. My phone is ringing. Hello, sweetheart. Love, oh, love, one, two, three. <laughs> Hello? Hey, Dito, Dito. What's up? Ah, this one that you're calling me today. And you didn't come to see me. I'm not interested. Look, 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 don't call my number again. I have told you I am not interested. I don't gamble anymore. You hear me? My friend, get off my phone. Can you imagine? Sorry. Yes? Hey. Can you imagine Dito just called me? Dito? Yes. Telling me he has one sure odd for me to gamble. 10K and win 1 million naira. What did you say? I, I'm not interested. He knew I was sick and he didn't come to see me. Can you imagine? What? You used to gamble. I don't do that anymore. Yeah. I'm a changed guy. So, why, why are you looking this way? Just to come and see me? Wait. Toby, did you just say you don't gamble anymore? Did I stutter? I don't. So wait, all this, look, it's just to come and see me. Yes, so see? how are you doing? Well, <laughs> seeing the... Right, told my man, hey. the man is man. They that? won, they won, they won, they won. Ah. I, I'm so happy for you. Bro, see, as 
love the hits you left and right. Hey, you are so complete. You are so complete. Oh my god. <laughs> From you. Don't worry, God will reward you. Ah, amen. Yeah. From your mouth to God's ears. I'm actually sure you don't hear that. That's right. God will do it for you. Yes. But yes. just that, my friend, my very good friend that worked so hard to turn me into a good man, is not here to enjoy it. But his work is fair. God knows the best. Hmm? Don't worry. <laughs> My man, don't listen to me. Right, too. I'm so happy now that you've turned to me again. Thank you. Thank Thank you. But right now, you pop something and you alcohol more drink. Alcohol. Yeah. 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 Right. Let's pop something. Alcohol. Right, I, I don't take alcohol nor smoke anymore. But I have juice in the fridge. Yeah, but have juice. Very cold juice. I can add ice to it for you. Uh, just to quench your thirst. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. Bro, hey, juice. <laughs> There's no problem. There's juice in the fridge. Uh-huh. So what I have to do is to go to that kitchen and fix something for us. It's food. 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 Better food. I drink no problem. Food. It's supposed to call you bright foodie. Well, as far as the food comes out. <laughs> Ah, you guys are my family now, and I appreciate you very so much. Thank you. Cheers. I know you're surprised to see us. It is true I came into your life at a point where things were terrible for you. And I'm aware of the fact that you accepted me out of pity. Yes, because I was all over you, I was pestering around, I was forcing myself to you just to prove how much I love you. But what did I gain? You kept on going back to Toby. Even when Toby was incapacitated, you were there for him. You were playing and flowing with him more than you do with me. I had to go through reality. And understand that we were meant to be friends and not lovers. You see, Juliet here, she has been there for me. She has been all over my neck. I can't even count the number of times that we fought. I can't count the number of times that I sent her out of my house. But she kept coming back. And begging. That is the type of love we all need. The way you love Toby. And the way Juliet loves me. But you see, how could you? After everything Toby did to you. You still went back to him. I wish you good, good luck. As for me, I have decided to move on with Juliet. James, how could you? 
Ramila, how could you do this to me? Huh? To us? How? Well, if you must know, in my life and the next, I will always be here for you. I mean, James, you showed me nothing but love. True love, unconditional love. And to prove my love and sincerity to you. And to also prove that I have nothing with Toby. I am ready to remain single. If I won't marry you, I would remain single as an honor to prove to you that I still love you. Mercy. 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 Hey man, we are here for your survival party. Get out. Huh? Get out of my house. It's okay, it's okay. Leave. You heard him. Leave. Get out! Leave! Oh, come down. Leave, thank you. Come on, with your food. You go find something to eat. Yeah. Yes, now. Don't stay here. Be kind all day. Let's move with your food, guy. Get out of my house. I will break your head. I said, get out. Move with your food. Come on. Let's go. Are you mad? I am sorry for everything. I died so many times knowing that I wouldn't set my eyes on you again. But here you are. Please. I am so sorry. You are the best thing that has ever happened to me. In my next life, I will still want you to be my mother. I promise you on this day that I will never hurt you or make you cry again. Never. Tobias, I've hurt you. And I am happy for your change of attitude. I'm so happy that you've really changed and become the real man I wanted you to be. Stand up. Get up and sit. Sit down.
am so happy. Honestly, I am happy to see you this way. I have a certain answer. Material things don't bother you. Seeing you alone is one more than a surprise you have for me. Mercy has me as well. For a song of life. So. <laughs> Come in! doing this for you right now. But I'm here for you to be. And I love you so much. I love you so much. You know that, right? You know, I thank God for the kind of man James is. He ran through my heart and he realized that my heart and soul yearns for you, thereby making a huge sacrifice to drop all his emotions just to allow reality to sail through. Yes. Yes, I know I was with him. But when we connected back, I, I, I don't know. I mean, my spirit and my emotions rested on you. And left James with mechanical attention. And James being the guy with the golden heart, he chose a path making way for true relationship to hold today. Yes. I'm sorry. And I'm grateful. I'm grateful for you and James. This means a lot to me. Mom and I, we had a serious meeting with James and we resolved that I should be here with you. So now, tell me, what do you see when you look at me? I see a woman with a very big heart. I see a woman that loves me so much. I see myself in your eyes. Honestly, this is my best. I love you most. 
Today that I lost my mind, it been a mess, been afraid. He got me right from the hook, yeah. I love him. My murder, he loves me, he cares for me. I love him, Mursta. I think that I lost my mind, it been a mess, been afraid. He got me right from the hook, yeah. I love him. My murder, he loves me, he cares for me. Where's my skin?